Good morning, everyone. I'm Pastor Jimmy Pickett, and the verse I want to share with you today is John chapter 1, verse 14. And it said, The Word was made flesh and dwelt among us. Folks, do you know who the Word is? Uh, John 1, 1 says, In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God. The Word was God. The Word, the living Word, is Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. Uh, folks, and, and he was made flesh. He was born of woman in the flesh to walk this earth. If you ever really stop to think about why Jesus Christ did that, why was he born in the flesh and walked the earth? I mean, other than the obvious, I mean, he died on the cross so that you could have forgiveness of sins and eternal life. He walked in the flesh so that he could show you how you could defeat Satan. He walked in the flesh so that he could show you how to deal with your trials and tribulations, folks. Uh, my daddy used to say all the time, we used to be in construction business together. And, and some of his employees, you know, he'd tell them to get up on the walk board. That's probably 15, 20 feet off the ground. And they didn't want to do it. And you know what? He'd crawl right up that ladder and get up on that walk board. And he'd say, you know what? I'd never ask you to do anything that I haven't done for myself. And you know what? One of the hardest things for us as Christians to do today is to lose the people that we love that pass from this life to the next one. But did Jesus ask you to do anything that he didn't do? We must all die, folks. It is a part of this life. Life is like a vapor. Uh, we need to cherish every minute that we have here, and we need to get out and spread the word of God to those that are lost. So he did, he's never asked you to do anything that he would not do. So what else did he accomplish when he died on that cross? He defeated death. Do you know who death is? It's Satan. And through that, we have the power over Satan. But we also, he defeated death. So guess what? That means you get to defeat death. In other words, when you pass from this flesh body, you never actually die. You pass from the flesh body into the spiritual body, and you are in the presence of God in heaven. Can I get an amen? Amen. Folks, if this has edified you today, hit your share button. Hit your share button. God's children are starving to death today for the word of God. Uh, folks, we're now brought to you by your tithes and offering. Hey, if we've helped you, help us continue to come to you. Would you do that? Hey, me and my wife want to give a shout out to each and every person following our ministry page. Uh, folks, we love you and your family. We love you so very much. And we're praying for you and your families each and every day. Hey, God bless you. And thank you so much for spending this time with me in the holy word of God.